In this video, we will show you how to add or avoid adding the spool or job log of an SAP Type R3 job to the job output. When running SAP R3 jobs from R3 or from Ctrl M, we can control the content of the job output based on our needs. From the planning domain of our Ctrl M workload automation GUI, we edit the properties of our SAP R3 job. By clicking on the SAP More option, we will see the other options available to define our SAP job. In the section Post Job Actions, Output Management, we find what information we can add or remove from the job execution output. The defaults are Spool, Don't Copy and job log copy to sysout. In other words, the job spool is not added to the job output and the job log is added. These values can be modified within the job and adjusted based on your needs. This is a per job definition that you can set differently for each job. When we've modified and saved our change, we execute the job and check how the content of the job output varies based on our job definition. This first example job shows output where the job log is included. Whereas this second job has been defined to not include the job log. A message indicating this is added to the output. That concludes this Ctrl M Solutions video. Please check our knowledge base or YouTube channel for more videos like this.